One of the things that people always ask us, you know, is, you know, what, what's the secret of your success and all of this. And I think that it's not lost on us how lucky we are that we met each other. We were two 13 year old kids who met and had a connection. We enjoyed Newcastle United. We liked the same TV programs. We used to watch Vic and Bob on the telly and we just we made each other laugh. Weird. Together. As a, we met as when we were 13 years old as kids uh, on a TV really? show, yeah. And we've grown up together and, and, and done all of that. <laughs> it was kind of written in the stars that we were going to bump into each other at some point because we, we get on so well I'm getting emotional now. Um, we have such an incredible bond, the two of us, that it was it was fate that we were um, going to meet. So I, I remember sending Dick a Christmas card, a Flintstones Christmas card, saying, have a yabba dabba do Christmas. Fancy <laughs> 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 coming to the Newcastle Grimsby game on Boxing Day. It's birthday, 25th of September. Correct. What are Dick's middle names? Uh, Joseph Oliver. Correct. How many siblings does Deck have? Six. Correct. Who is the eldest sibling? Uh, Patricia. Wow, yes. Uh, what game caused Deck's biggest argument with you? <laughs> Who wants to be a millionaire? Correct. What was the first record Deck bought? Uh, Gold Brown by the Stranglers. How do you know this? Yes. What is Deck's favourite karaoke song? Uh, Piano Man, Billy Joel. <laughs> Correct. What was Deck's first car? Uh, MG Metro. Turbo. <laughs> Turbo. <laughs> Deck has appeared in Alien Autopsy, but what other film? Uh, love actually. Correct. In feet and inches, how tall is Deck? I've got no idea. Five, four, six? Yes! Oh, what's Deck's shoe size? Seven. Yes! What kind of dance did Deck do as a child apart from body popping? Irish dancing. Correct. Where does. The... Oh, oh! No! But I started, so I'll finish up. Always wanted to say that! <laughs> Here we go. Last question. Um, um, where does Deck fit in age order of his siblings? He. in age order? Bottom. Yes, he's the youngest. Yeah. Wow, yeah. we! And you scored 13 versus yeah. her! Yeah. I didn't know half of them. And when is it Ant's birthday? 18th of November. Correct. What is the name of Ant's mother? Christine. Correct. What was the second song at Ant's wedding? I predict Ryan. Correct. How many sisters does Ant have? Two. Yes. Uh, what are these sisters called? Sarah and Emma. Correct. What did Ant buy you for Christmas? Uh, a pair of uh, Nike trainers. Correct. What's Ant's favourite kind of takeaway? Chinese. Correct. Where did Ant get engaged? Uh, Dubai. Correct. Where did Ant's mum work? Uh, Marks and Spencer's. Correct. What would Ant have as the starter of his death row meal? Uh, Greg's sausage roll. Yes, very precise. <laughs> What's Ant's favourite position <laughs> on the pitch? <laughs> Goalie. Correct. Uh, does Ant oh. wear tight whiteies or boxer shorts? Tight whiteies. No, boxer shorts. No. What's Ant's favourite pizza topping? Pepperoni. Oh! oh. Just in! Well done, but not good enough. Uh, no. This question is about your partner, Deck. What is Deck's favourite sexual position? <laughs> but before you answer, yeah. let him tell me. <laughs> so he's like, oh, yeah, it is. <laughs> now, this is obviously a guess, because I don't know this. Oh, you know. Yeah. But I, I hazard a guess, knowing them as well as I do. Reverse cowgirl. <laughs> What was Ant's first pet called, and what was it? Ah. Right, so Ant's first pet name, and what was it? We've got a Scooby, Scooby, a dog. A dog. Scooby, a dog. How about that? Who's got the biggest feet? Points. Nothing else said on that one. <laughs> <laughs> Who speaks to their mum more often? Oh, uh, uh. What's Ant's favourite smell? Ant's oh, that's a good question. Three, two, one, reveal. Bacon on cut grass. <laughs> <laughs> when have you ever experienced that? I dropped my bacon sandwich, <laughs> which I love the smell of, but I love the smell of cut, cut grass. grass. So, you must have got this. Well, I got half of it. <laughs> yes! What did you get? Oh, the bacon half. I thought you might get the cut grass half. <laughs> I didn't think you were going to be that specific. <laughs> yeah. Right. What's the worst thing? That happened to Deck whilst on holiday <laughs> with you and. Okay. Reveal the answer, please! I burnt the tops of my feet and I had to stay in the whole villa for a week. <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah, I couldn't walk. It was so bad. Yeah, let the kids used to point out, there's the boy with the burnt feet. <laughs> Antigua, 1996. Oh, okay, uh, did you get it right? He burnt his feet! He burnt his feet! There you go.
seven all. Do you know something? Yeah. That's it. You clearly made for each other. Oh, oh. yes, come here. Amazing match. Well done, but since we saw you last, you know, I've been I've been reading the papers and I've been reading that 70% of the great British public don't know which one's Ant and which one's <laughs> Nobody cares which one's Richard the Double Act. I am. Man of the moment. The man of the moment. Ant. <laughs> <laughs> Ant. 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 Which one are you again? I don't know. I think I'm dead. Well, Ant. <laughs> no, that's the wrong oh, way. Oh, yeah. way. Right. Now, and by the way, I feel... Like if you want to mix it up, you don't have to. Do you always have to? Do you have to? We can, what's, yeah, it, what's it this way? Ant and Dick. We kind of do, because if we don't, then people go, Oh, I saw you and you weren't sitting the right way around, and people remark on it, so we do it. We, we, we like in restaurants and taxis, do you do it like this? We can. Yeah, yeah. It just ends up being like this, yeah. Not consciously, but we always end up sitting like this. Like we yeah, sit, we, like, do, we yeah. sat like this in the car on the way here. Yeah. We, we're like yeah. this in bed. I'm on this side. Yeah. <laughs> You guys are doing a stunt at the moment because you're sitting the wrong way around. You're doing deck and out. Do you want to swap round? No, I don't know. You never want to go and it's shitful. That's what it was. It was like missing people at home. That feels better. One of these days, I'll, I'll get it. What will you do with it? Oh, you win! <laughs> He's very quick with his tongue. Next question. I got the scissors out. Yeah. Well, this is quite the interview on the last thing. Yeah. Who did it? Now I'm smelling your hair. Right, we were trying to sort out the lines. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's that's. We don't kiss each, each other. Right here. No, we don't. I'll try something. Oh, yeah. You like this, sir? Okay, that's got a little. Uh, maggots, oh, scorpions, worms, ants. <laughs> so I feel that the furniture is now too outdated. I'll have it. Throw on a lift ball. Thanks. Thanks. Yeah, just use mine. I'll just use your pockets every now and again. Oh, yeah, it feels good. That feels great. Good. It does feel good. <laughs> we had an actual pair in.
They are ant salt and pepper shakers. They? <laughs> They're two ants on a leaf. One's a salt cellar, one's a pepper cellar. A dead boy. <laughs> We have an about that. It would be nasty. <laughs> I thought my friend Ant would like the salt and pepper ants, so I bought them for him. Yeah. Oh. Oh. I'll be back from America. Don't touch them, you moron. <laughs> you won't know this, but I bought, actually bought Ant a hoverboard for Christmas. Yes, and yes, he did. Why Hold my mic for me, darling, will you? Thank you. <laughs> oh, oh. Darling. <laughs> Is that your new catchphrase? Put him on mic if you would. Thank you very much, Deck. Just keep me on the mic. Thanks, darling. It's okay, Miss. Really? Really? Yeah, just got that. That's it. That's the one. Really? Just on your mark, my love. That's the one. Right. Hold that. You little smoothie. I'm not going to let go. You're going to let go. Yeah, it is. It's about a kilo, so it's a real sharer. I could I could knock it off. No, no, two two slices would be my max, I reckon. Yeah, yeah. It's because enough. it is really rich as well, so there's loads, loads, loads of flavour. <laughs> <laughs> we have you, yeah. and then we have... So this is from... Last November. 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 Yeah. So the TV show, there was... Da -da -da -da. <laughs> and then... Oh, and then Declan, gotta love him, here to go. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> Which, oh, we think sounds like... Which is scrappy do. Scrappy do. Yeah. power. Scrappy do. <laughs> I like like that we that is his little nickname. Well, oh, don't say that! <laughs> Why did you say that? <laughs> is it really? I'm on your face, you dirty devil. That you've actually got an insurance policy out, haven't you? Uh, <laughs> yeah, one of you carks it, then you get a big payout. We've insured each other, yeah. So, so if Ant was to 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 die in horrific circumstances, <laughs> then I'd be in, I'd be quids in, I'd be in the money. <laughs> it would be like winning the lottery. <laughs> They actually have a genuine friendship. I mean, I find it amazing. I mean, they really do like each other. I've never seen them argue. What they do have is a really genuine friendship. And lots of great dumplings haven't necessarily been great friends, but I think if you are genuinely friends, then it can come across sometimes in, in what you do. They are like one life form. Eric and Ernie were like that. Uh, two halves of the whole. Why don't me and you just play together? Shall we? Shall we? They are like an old married couple, aren't they? I don't think one would even contemplate going off and doing something uh, on their own. Over the threshold. What? Okay. Imagine the joy at looking at your baby boy. Oh, baby boy. Rasputin. Oh, yeah. Ras Rasputin? <laughs> yeah. It's my mum's name. Uh, Rasputin, Beardsley, Bingo, McPartland. <laughs> McPartland? McPartland, Donnelly, you mean? What makes you think you're the man in this relationship? I do. And you're going to do what I tell you, all right? Oh, I say the honeymoon period's over now, is it? <laughs> no more flowers and chocolates. As soon as you get that ring on my finger, it's no more Mr. Nice Guy. You're just like all the others. I should have listened to me, mother. Oh, for goodness! You decided not to, as per bloody usual. <laughs> I didn't get a say in the matter, but it's fine. We move on. Oh, not this again. Yes, this again. Yes, this again. <laughs> After 25 years together, I think I just deserve a bit more respect. Look, everybody's listening. Can we talk about this at home? No, we'll talk about it now in front of everybody. Why not? Hang on, hang on. Before you go, yes? so you're just going to leave me here. Yeah, I do this all the time. Every week I do this. I go to the audience, talk to the audience, on my favourite parts of no, the show. No, it's fine. You do whatever you want to do. Don't worry about me. <laughs> because I want to talk to some people in tonight's audience whose other halves spend their entire life doing exactly what they want to do. Takes one to know one. <laughs> Let's leave this at home, love. Let's just leave this at home. <laughs> very good at that. <laughs> yeah, it's just Ooh, ooh. Mm, ah, ooh. Uh, coffee, coffee, tea, hot coffee, milk, froth latte. Um, what? What's this? <laughs> I'm what the hell? It's a kettle! <laughs> <laughs> a kettle! <laughs> 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 it's boiling! Wow! Wow! What about the classic? <laughs> yeah, 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 exactly! That's what I would have done! A whistling kettle! Oh yeah, I never thought of that. <laughs> Pressing the clicker on the bottom of the kettle. That's a very that old that fashioned kettle. Well, I would have got it. What kind of kettle have you got? I would have got it. You just put it in and put it. <laughs> <laughs> well, that could be anything. Click. <laughs> You could be setting the video on. Yes. You could have been just putting the lamp switch well, on. You click it, and then when it's followed by. <laughs> no, I mean, what's that? <laughs> That's the water bottle. Is it really? <laughs> right. Wow. 18 of 22. That's right, Mr. Deceitful. It is. <laughs>
<laughs> you're not quite over this yet, are you? I'm not over it. Don't let you lie to me. Who who brought your attention to the fact that I may have? I saw it on Instagram stories. We share an Instagram account. Uh, Didn't think it through, did you? Not, no, no, not really. Uh. Just you know, you're well known as being good mates and chums, you know, and all mm -hmm. this sort of thing. Um, about a fight that you had. Is this really the only yeah, fight yeah. that the two of you have ever really, had? It's genuinely the only fist fight we've ever had, if you can call it that. It's a really rubbish fight as well. It's really bad. It started bad. off good though, didn't it? It started off really good, and I think I caused it brilliantly. Well, we're not. Yeah. We, were, we're, we were in, in Tormelinos <laughs> doing GMTV's Fun in the Sun. Okay. And oh, I know it well. uh, got pretty drunk, because uh, when you're a Brit abroad, that's the first thing you do, yeah. just find a bar. Uh, and then we should have been in bed hours ago uh, and ended up staying up late. And then you ranted and raved at me for some reason, which, yeah, this yeah. kind of went on at me. And then, then he shut up and I thought, well, I'm going to have my say. So just as I started back on him, he went, La 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 <laughs> How annoying is that? That's very really annoying. Yeah. yeah. So Carol, I punched him in the chest. Wow. Oh, yeah. oh, what he struck me. Me. I'm not proud of it, but I was very proud of it. <laughs> and then he uh, struck me, so I was really shocked. I was like that. I was like that. I should go la la. He just punched me in the chest. <laughs> So he was wearing, he used, to, you know, he used to wear a cap all the time, so yeah. I kind of, I looked at him and went like that. And I flipped his cap. <laughs> <laughs> so I mean, I was, we'd had so much to drink, I was, a bit, I was a bit of a bad shot, and I just hit, caught the edge of it, and all I kind of did was just made it wonky. <laughs> so he's standing there, he's lifting there with somebody with us, and he went, break it up, break it up! <laughs> we already have! <laughs> that did it rubbish! That was, that that was, was it. We, we, well, I mean, we've argued a few times, uh, Dex's very, very competitive when it comes to, like, okay. board games and... and, and Card games and stuff yeah. like that. And even, Quite a sore loser. And you argued over a board game? Oh, yeah, I mean, ah, yeah. yeah. I'm when glad you mentioned that. Because that is, is it a, still unresolved. That is a dirty. That is a dirty it. trick. Well, not really. We played Who Wants to Be a Millionaire uh, round oh, Anne's house one day. We just got the board game. game. <laughs> what? And uh, it's all in the book, by the way. You don't have to listen. You read it in the book. But um, so it was. It was this one question and I thought mm, it's a 50 50 that I, I thought it's either Ruth Rendell or Agatha Christie they're the two <laughs> answers they're the two so he said it out loud and I was playing the role of Tarrant so he said I'll have a 50 50 so I took away the other two leaving <laughs> Ruth Rendell or Agatha Christie what a dirty that's trick a mis that's a mistake though you see thanks that. thanks but they would never do that on the telly see Tarrant would never do Tarrant that. would do that he wouldn't do that well Tarrant wouldn't do but the show would do it no they wouldn't wouldn't they? <laughs> I think they would. No, they wouldn't! <laughs> yeah, you see? Don't you go to jail. You'll flick the boy and they'll take yeah, a game Three <laughs> against one. No, so what happened was, he got really hearty and then took his board game home. <laughs> I did, I packed did up the you? game and took it home. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's the only way you can teach somebody like, like that. <laughs> if you can't play fairly, well, we won't play it. It's my game, and I'm taking it home. <laughs> Still one more to go. Do you know what? Just for fun. Do you want to be the fun? Just for fun. Just you. Just you. See if you can get it, shall we? Look, here you go. Right, what is it? What is it? What's it? Pediatrician. I should have that. Physician, you can have it. Go. It's, it's, uh. He's actually stopping himself. I'm sick. Look. Amanda Canberra. No. Oh, it's Africa, not Australia. Uh, Amanda, Amanda Zimbabwe. <laughs> Amanda Rwanda. Oh, no. Amanda Uganda. Yes! I used to do the more cooking. Yeah. Right. Yeah. There's always one who does and one there who doesn't. Isn't. Yeah. Were you the tidy one? Yeah. Yeah. God damn. I think we were finding out what's going on here. <laughs> <laughs> he was very anal. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> so have you two ever cooked together? Nah. In yeah, tandem? Kind of. Well. We lived together. I've so watched him. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and I. Uh, well, he passed his stuff. I wash up. <laughs> but, you know, it's just that's. No, we're no. always working together and, you know, we love each other's company. We're our best pals. Yeah. When we're not working, we go out and socialise and we're around each other's houses and we just get on. You know, a lot of people don't believe it, but we do. We get on very well. So we just like being around each other. Knock, knock, knock. Any pops for some tea. Got any food? Which one of you has never told the other that they didn't stop them eating a dog treat muffin? <laughs> 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 Remember the other week when we went back to mine after watching Newcastle play? Yes. 
I would have had a few beers. Yes. <laughs> and there was some yes. little muffins on the cooler rack. Right they were nice. My wife. <laughs> there were cakes for the dog. <laughs> yum, yum, yummy! Here's your have one. Have you come in a time machine? This is Ant and Dex. Official Canada 2019. Have you knocked this up then? Have you and your brother? Me and my brother. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's a the story there. Here we go. There's <laughs> January. Hey, right. Here's January. Hey, hey, My eyes. I'm going to be honest on this one. I had to mop that one up. <laughs> <laughs> the next one yeah, is for real. Oh, little massage. Oh. Gets a very stiff lower back, don't you, Dom? I do, I do. Yeah. <laughs> got very tight glutes. You can see that. We're going to call that Massage March. Massage yeah. March, yes. Now, what have we got here? Oh. oh. We're revealing your tats. Oh, You're giving Lord. me tats away. <laughs> Let's see, what have we got next? Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, beautiful. Oh, my beautiful. God. You see another right. half a sandwich each? Yeah, he's in yeah, the I'll share. Like, I'll like do everything together. Yeah, yeah. Let's like see what we've got, sir. Uh, oh. Oh. You need a spray up there, don't you? <laughs> do you remember that time when we all had a spray up together? Yes. What a day oh. that was. <laughs> and that's not a joke. Oh. Oh. August. Oh. Are we only at August? Wait, yeah. yes. <laughs> goodness. Oh. They were bad times. Oh, God. Hey. But we need to get back on track. Yeah, we do. And yeah. that's how we... It's, oh, right. it's a little bit of rough and tumble. Towards the end of the year, November. <laughs> this year is dragging. Go on, pop a bit of Christmas music on. <laughs> and there's your trip. There <laughs> it is. That's for you. Uh -huh. You don't need to share it. Yep. Made up too. Oh, brilliant. Oh, right. oh, and uh, we'll speak about this a bit later on. I've got a different December. <laughs> but You've got an option of two. Happy Christmas. Thanks, dude. See you later. Thanks, guys. Asked anyone to be your. Have you asked anyone to be your best man? <laughs> I've been mm. thinking about yeah. it long and hard. Yeah. Is it because you want it yeah. to be a genuine friend? Yeah. I want, I want you want to be someone some... who's close to you, don't you? Yeah, yeah. 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 I want, I want to be... It's only enough for a long time. Somebody who. It's only you get on with. <laughs> yeah. You know. All of those things, it has to be somebody like that. So I haven't asked anybody yet. Why? Right. Okay. I'm, okay. I'm close to asking somebody. Okay. So you're not. Have you got. I suppose there's quite a lot of people it could be then in your what? head. Because you're. you're... <laughs> You've got a lot of yeah, friends, I've I know that. What are you talking, you've got one friend, it's me! <laughs> I've got one friend, it's you! Yeah. <laughs> what do you bet it's going to be Robbie Williams? <laughs> 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 uh, me and Alan were having a great chat backstage. Well, we well, got Alan, Alan, if he asked you, would you be his best man? I mean, you can ask him now if you... I mean, do you want to do this now? Are you, are I you... mean, it's best not to do it on telly, isn't it? You know, <laughs> these kind of things are personal. Have you got a busy summer, Alan? I'm thinking about doing I'm it in the totally summer. I'm totally available. I don't want the other fella there, though. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the other fella. And you know what, that works. Alan, Alan, Alan Deck Deck works. Alan. Deck and Alan's fine. But but you presumably it's going to have to be. You yeah. can't not. Yeah, yeah. No, genuinely, I have asked. I've asked okay. that, and he's going to do it for me. Oh, that's so nice. I can't bloody wait. Because, uh... <laughs> Waiting. Yes. Oh, so, uh, have, have you chosen your best man yet? <laughs> yes. Yes, 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 I have. Yeah, I have. Uh, Tom from Accounts is thrilled. <laughs> yeah, he couldn't do it, so I've asked that. Yeah, uh, yeah. No, yeah, so I'm getting a bit nervous about it, though, because oh, the yeah. speech is underway and. It's all there, my friend, friend, don't you worry. Stag he knows where all the bodies are buried. Yeah. Exactly, yeah. exactly. Yeah. I'm more nervous about the stag do's. Yes, quite yeah. nervous. Yeah. 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 A stylish entrance arriving in an Aston Martin. He was, of course, accompanied by his presenting partner, Ant, who played a key role in the ceremony as best man. Wearing matching dark blue suits, the pair posed for fans outside the church. I uh, was Dex's best man yeah. uh, a couple of years ago. I got um, VT messages of famous people like Coldplay and from Williams and stuff. Yeah. And they all did love it, and we got one. The surprise was sweet. That, that was the one. <laughs> that was the one. That was the one. <laughs> Life. Sure. Um, and thank you to everybody, and thanks to you, my thank man. Well done. Very thank good. You. Yeah, look good in the wig. It's doing all right.
whatsoever about this. Um, I I, where do you start? I think you start with. Thanks, man. Thanks. I don't know. I don't know what else. No, it's almost like we have now. No. There's, now there's no ego completely, and 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 if we were to do something on a show, uh, we would never sit there and and kind of line count. Or I think a lot of double acts that got together were individual performers beforehand. So you you probably still had that individual ego, and you would kind of see how many lines, who got the laugh, mm. that kind of thing. Um, but we don't, you know. And it's all for, for us. It's it's whoever, you know. You, you want you. We don't care who gets the laugh or who gets the lines as long as you get one. And and get. Thank you very much. Uh, I'm shaking. Uh, it's, been, it's been a very emotional night tonight. Um, it's been quite a year. It's been quite a tough 12 months. Um, so winning this tonight really, really means a lot. I'd first like to thank all my family, all my friends. Uh, some of you are here tonight. I love you. Thank you very much. But thank you to all of you for your support. It really, really means the world to me. It's helped me get through. And thanks to you, little guy. I love you, man. Thank you. Uh, Morning. Well, let's not cry. But most importantly, all you guys at home, thank you so much for continuing to enjoy what we do. We love it and we'll keep doing it as long as you want us to. Thank Thanks you. so much. Cheers, everyone. Thank you. Because you did break the rules. It was an outrage. Yeah. Well, with it being the final. Shut <laughs> up, man! <laughs> Every time it's him, isn't it? Yeah, yes! Oh, ho! I don't know! He's Steven. desperate to be on the telly. No. <laughs> memory of James firmly up there he wasn't quite the Jack the lad we thought he was he was just doing what he needed to do for his family um, it's given you a real sense of yourself yeah and who you are yeah, yeah that's how I feel Blue. tell you what though there's no messing about with your spell is there just put a D on the end just for the sake of it see, <laughs> see how it sounds Put a little D on the end, I don't know why, I just put a D on. <laughs> <laughs> That was amazing. That was lovely, yeah. really lovely. What, do you, do you know this song? The, um... Oh. We played that about Dad's funeral. Oh my God! Oh. Um.
bit, it's a bit full on. It's a bit, you know, yeah. it's like an emotional bomb, isn't it? Yeah. Um, and then she started singing that song, I went. And obviously I was at your dad's funeral, I don't remember, I mean, I remember being at the funeral, mm. but that song didn't yeah, have that won't, significance yeah. to me. But yeah. Cool. Hey, hey. Got a nice bunch of <laughs> <laughs> I was incredibly angry at, at, the, at the start. So angry. Good boy, good boy. Disappointed in him that he didn't ever come to me and say, I'm struggling, I need you. Because that's, I thought if this shoe was on the other foot, I would have gone to him and said, I'm in trouble and I can't handle this, I need your help. And he never came to me. And that hurt me a lot. Ultimately, the care and compassion you have for that person overrides all of those other emotions and you just want them to get well and you want to be a support for them and you want, more than anything, I just wanted them to be happy. Um, it's, been, uh, it's been a fun series. Um, as, as we get to it, at the, the end here, um, it's tinged with, uh, I don't know. Uh, um, yeah, we, we do, we do. It's tinged with a little bit of sadness, so... Um, would you just give one round of applause to one who's back home? Yeah! Thank you so much. We appreciate that. A great, great deal. <laughs> um, yeah, it's it's nerve-wracking for us because it's just so chaotic. Um, but it's fine. I'm in safe hands, and you're going to lead the way. <laughs> we'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> Please the way. Uh, no, it's, it's, it, it will be all right. I think we've, we've, we've kind of been through it. Wow. Wow. Uh, thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> thank you. Are you in you were in it? Aren't you? Uh, I'd like to say thank you to Holly for helping me out last year. We did a fantastic job. Um, standing in for Ant, who has reluctantly come up here tonight. There he is. <laughs> because he's part, still part of the team, obviously. So we wanted him up here to celebrate with It's such a relief to have him back and have him there. He was a bit drafty before, you know, he was a bit, he was a bit cold down this side. I'd never noticed the breeze that comes down this side before when you're on your own. As well. Thank you very much. It, it, it means a lot to be back together on the red carpet and uh, we're still have a good night. Did you? Little <laughs> face back on the red carpet. Yeah, was there ever a nice. moment when you worried that you might not be back here in the kind of on this red carpet with with Dexter? Of course, yeah, of course I did. But you know, it's uh, hard work and you know, getting through and support of a true friend like Deck and the public is, you know, we got I got there. So I tell you what, it was amazing to be back together, dude. It, it was, wasn't it? Really and it's so yeah. 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 Right, things are shaping up for the final of Britain's Got Talent. We've got our standing judges for rehearsals. There they are. Look. My co-host Ant McPartland's over here. Yeah. There he is. Hello. <laughs> Ant's picking his outfit for this evening. Let's see if we can find him. There he is. Choose me suit for tonight. Go so on. I'm wearing this little tux. Nice. Right with a dicky ball. Dicky ball. Look at this though. Too much. Mmm. Mmm. see, guys. He's getting his hair done. Have you just worked out how to do this? Is that why you're yeah, excited? Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> Get off! <laughs> Pick up Seriously. You. <laughs> Seriously. Seriously, get ready, man. Has anybody seen Ant? Have you got a new phone? Uh, so, Ant, really tell us about the show tonight. It's very yeah. good. What are you doing? Ha ha! What have you got? <laughs> what is it? Ha ha, you're a dog. <laughs> Are you ready? Yes, I'm Are ready. You ready? Uh -huh. Yes, I'm ready. Morning. It's, uh, it's just get in here and do a little hide. <laughs> you, you little twerp! You're hiding the full well floor. Is it come to this? Are you proud of yourself? <laughs> Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Work Proud of yourself? Work though, isn't you it? little twerp! Work though. What are you doing there? What was them? What were them? What? Where are your glasses? They're not, they're not glasses. They are glasses? Sunglasses? Do you wear glasses? No. <laughs> yes, you do. I Put them back on. You look very handsome though. Put them back on. <laughs> Show the people. They want to see you with the on. I just wear them reading. Just sometimes. Well, put them on then. <laughs> Got ourselves a 
good old Mexican standoff here. Ah, uh, ah, uh, you got it yesterday. Well, we need to decide how to do it. We toss a coin? Toss a coin. Toss a coin. Right, got a big ass Australian 50 pence piece. The big arm, man. Big, big. I'm not going to toss it. I'll tell you what, arm. Which hand is it? Oh, yeah, go on, man. Which hand is it? Sure? Yeah. You don't want to change? Yeah. Yes. Unlucky! Got it! <laughs> Trap! <laughs> To demonstrate how powerful we can connect as human beings, human beings. I knew two individuals who have an undeniable bond. Does. A connection established in 1989, 30 years ago this very year, can add and death. Please join me. This. Uh, okay. Death, take a seat to my right. And there. Ant, please sit to my left. Right. Right. The wrong way around. Gentlemen, gentlemen, can you both please close your eyes now? Close your eyes now. You must pay close attention to all sensations you may feel. If you felt a touch, please raise your right hand. Now lower your hands and once again pay close attention to all sensations. 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 If you felt a touch, raise your right hand. Huh? And now point to where you felt that touch. Felt that touch. Oh my god. This time, remember how many times you feel a touch. You feel a touch. If you felt a touch, raise your right hand. Raise your right hand. And now with your right fingers, show us how many times you felt a touch. Lower your hands and open your eyes now. Your connection is incredible, incredible. For the ultimate test of connection, please take a pen each. I also have a board for you both. For this to possibly work, let your subconscious minds connect. connect. Correct. Begin drawing now. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, one. one. When two people are truly connected, the impossible is possible. Ant and Deck, you may open your eyes. Open your eyes. Your connection with each other is truly inspiration. We have just witnessed the ultimate connection. No way. An undeniable bond that was established 30 years ago in 1989. <laughs> wow, that was freaky! Can we be in all the acts like that? <laughs> ah. David! That was... the spookiest thing we've ever seen on Brown's Got Talent. Yeah, it had it. It was one incredible bit of magic after another. I got to every time. I did, every time. 
perfect act. Well done. What do you mean? That moment when you touched Ant and Deck felt it like sent chills through me. Fantastic. I just want I want to see more and more and more. It was wonderful. Thank you. Amanda. I feel like it was very eerie and very spooky, but I couldn't stop watching. Really amazing. Extraordinary is the word because it is impossible to do what you just did unless you have magic powers. It was actually very emotional as well, actually. Yeah. I have to give you for what you just did your first yes. It was amazing. It's a yes from me. Thousand yeses, well done. It was just like a movie. It was just like a song. Can I ask the boys a second? I want to. I want to ask you, both of you. Yeah. Honestly, you knew nothing about that at all. Yeah, nothing. Nothing. Nah. We, we didn't even speak backstage because obviously he doesn't speak. Nah. I could use who. Who did get touched? You. Me. You. Yeah. But he didn't touch you. Yeah. Didn't well, somebody did. Well, no, they, did. they didn't. They didn't. You're like twins. Good. Good. You must have sensed it. Well, I felt it. Yeah. You're all through. Brilliant. Amazing. Brilliant. Well done. Well done. Well done. Well done. Well done. Well done. Inspiring. He is inspiring. Well Last magician, it was amazing. Well done. It was, a, it was an honour to be a part of it as well. Thank See you, you so much. See you next time. Thank you. It was just wow. like a song when we were young. Ant and Deck. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Wow, ah, oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. This is a, thank you. This is a genuine shock, especially this year. Uh, I'm shaking here. Um, we want to say thank you to everybody. Um, I mean, I really don't feel like I can accept this award this year. This is the one reason we won the award this year is because of this guy. His hard work, dedication, wit, funniness and being the best mate there is out there. I love you, man. Well done. Thank you. Um, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you to everybody who sent kind and, and, and thoughtful messages to us over the past year. They've kept me going while I've been flying the flag for the two of us. But I've got him back now and now we're back together. Uh, thank you to everybody at ITV and James Grant for your continued support. But this year, probably more than ever, thank you to all of you who picked up the phone and voted for us. This Thanks so much. So Special mention to Dermot, who said he was going to chuck the towel in if we won this year. So, happy retirement, Dermot. <laughs> See ya. Uh, Ollie and Caroline, you're back on the X. <laughs> Listen, it's good to be back. Well done, pal. Thank, you. thank well done. you. Thanks, everybody. Good night. All of our success and everything that's ever happened to us has been a byproduct of this amazing friendship that the two of us have. That everything we've we've that, that has happened to us has been because of our friendship. We haven't got a career. We haven't got a friendship because of our career or because of anything else. It's always been our friendship that has come first. Too much fun working together, and honestly, we both feel so blessed that we get up to go to work every day with a job that I love with my best friend. Life could not be any better. Yeah, we do lots of serious things, but we do lots of fun things. And it's like, like you guys, it's like it's working with your best mate. Yeah, mm, there's nothing lucky. better. Mm, there's nothing lucky. better. Very nothing lucky. better. You're so lucky, the pair of you.
<laughs> What's the best thing about working together? <laughs> the best thing about working together is we're best mates. So, you know, who doesn't like going to work with their best mate? We're so lucky. We've got three amazing shows on the channel. Takeaway, Britain's Got Talent, and I'm a celebrity. And, you know, every day I get to go to work with my best mate. Yeah, yeah. And we try and make each other laugh. Yeah. We have, we have got the best gig in the world. Most importantly, I think, you know, neither of us would be here if it wasn't for each other. So, um... Don't, don't stop that. Oh, yeah. so, I love you, man. Love you the best. I love you the best. <laughs> I love you, man. Thank you. I love you, man. Well done. Deck means the world to me. You know, I love him. We're, we're friends. We're, we've got that brotherly connection. You know, he means, he means the world to me. Deck, you know, his, his well-being, his happiness, his health um, means everything to me. I'm at my happiest and my most content when we're together and working and having fun and hanging out and he's like another part of me. He's like, it would be like losing a limb if I lost him from my life. We've cried and we've hugged and we've laughed and we've realised again why, why we're such good friends. I suppose nobody knows Ant and Dec better than we do. When we're together, there's nothing that we can't do. We're BFs forever, always gonna be me and you.